as I was saying, you'd need a lot of courage to keep going as an artist because the kind of worldly rewards are not always there. In art school, you keep painting the model, and then you get out of art school and you go, well, what am I going to paint? You can do quite a lot with a mirror. <laughs> and um, you can paint yourself over and over and over. It was done in front of a large mirror, uh, 1974. And um, I, still, I still love this portrait. And then I tried hi hiring models. And um, I wasn't always that interested in doing the model. And then I did a couple of still lifes. I wasn't that interested in that. You do, you do try a lot of things that don't work, and you have to know when, when to give up on them. It's sort of this daily search for some kind of truth, some kind of beauty uh, in the world. What I liked to do was photograph my daughter because she liked to play dress up with her friends, you know. And so I would take these pictures with the idea that I would one day do paintings from them. And they just, I put them in a shoebox, and then I moved here, and then I was teaching here, and one of my students didn't have anything to work on. The model didn't show up. I got out the shoebox. I said, here, paint from one of these. It's always good to step back, which is a good lesson in life. You could get too close to things, you don't really see them. And he started painting it, and I just, it was just like, you just lit a match. I get, oh, yeah, that's what I want to do. So I started painting these pictures of those little girls playing dress up, all kinds of fantastic costume. And um, that, I won the National Endowment Fellowship in Painting for that work. And I knew, I knew immediately that it was what I wanted to express, something about childhood, the loss of childhood, the loss of time, that uh, wonderful, fantasy life that you have as, as a child that kind of gets knocked out of you. There are always these turning points because you do get, you get, you get stale. You have to find another way to say what you want to say or another part of yourself that you haven't explored. Uh, and I think that I've been very, very successful at, at doing that. Mm -hmm.